Now, as you can see, the trees are really uh, rocking and rolling out here. We probably have like steady, what, 25 mile an hour winds? Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to go up into the mountains up there. I don't know if you can see. That is uh, San Jacinto, and you can barely see it with all the sand. So, yeah, it's rough going across that way. This is always the windiest area anywhere around here. See, over there, all that haze is not haze, it's actually sand. So, yep. So we're going to go off and uh, go up and over those other mountains over here and go to storage and get all our shit, I mean our stuff. Now we're going to go up there to storage and we're going to put all our our stuff in storage. First we got to go use the trash here and uh, yeah, I think what we're going to do is I'm going to take down that antenna. You can see it's bending and I don't want it to bend any more than it is. So take that antenna down right now before we leave. All right. All right. While we do this, we'll be back and we'll be uh, up there by storage. So guys, we are in Joshua Tree. We just went to storage. We uh, grabbed all the stuff that we didn't want from the camper and we put it in storage. And now we're gonna get something to eat. So we were gonna go to Joshua Tree Saloon, but they're busy. They're just right back over this way, back to all these connexes. Um, so we decided to go over here to the Mexican restaurant that we normally go to. They're open and we're gonna run inside and get something to eat. So uh, let's check it out. All right, guys, so you can uh, see that it's a little windy out here. You can hear it. Uh, we've got to put on our mask and we've got to go inside to, what's the name of the restaurant? Castaneda's. Castaneda's. And that's where we uh, usually go to eat. There is a bunch of them down here. Um, really good tacos. Really good burritos too, right? Mm -hmm. Chimichangas are good. So, hey, that's what we're going to go do. We're going to have some Mexican food and then we're gonna go do shopping. So that's kind of boring. We won't bring you along with that. <laughs> Come on, check it out. Let's go inside and check out the food. And the prices are bad at all. It's for whole dinners. So, a la carte, we got some good beers. So let's go on inside. So here at Castaneda's, I got two um, tacos, but they're not tacos. Because I ordered wrong, they didn't order wrong. And then they asked me what kind of tortillas I wanted, I said corn, but that was what they were going to give me on the side. So what did I end up with? Chili rellenos. So I like chili rellenos, so I got two chili rellenos, I guess. It has a little guacamole on it, and it has the beans, and it has the rice. She got... She got a chicken chimichanga. So this place is packed. Uh, a bunch of kids came in from Canada, French Canadians, I believe. And uh, we're gonna eat our food now, and then we're gonna get the heck out of here, right? Mm -hmm. Gotta go do shopping. Yes. Bummer. Shopping can't go on, on an empty stomach though. You gotta, you gotta fill up before you go because shopping. Otherwise, you get all the crap that you don't need. All right, guys. Check us out. That was good. Uh, I was supposed to have two tacos, chicken tacos, <laughs> corn tortillas. Ended up with two chili rellenos, which were okay. But last time I had the chili rellenos, I really didn't like them, and I told her I wasn't going to get a chili relleno, and then I ended up with two of them. So, the food was really good. Uh, we're going to go now to do some shopping. This wind is still really bad here. So, uh, yeah. We'll see you probably back home. All right, guys, so we're heading back to the truck. Let's see what our dog is doing. It's 
sneak up on him. He's up on the totes because he can't get on the can't get in his bed. Poor guy. Well, good afternoon, everybody. This is the next day. So this is Tuesday. Uh, yesterday we had some errands to do. We went up and did storage. Uh, we were going to go eat at uh, Joshua Tree Saloon, but it was so packed because it was President's Day that didn't happen for us. So uh, now what we're doing is uh, we're actually going to go to the store we didn't finish yesterday. Uh, we're supposed to leave tomorrow, and I'll show you in a minute what's going on. Uh, the news was just saying that this is the coldest part of the winter right now, and uh, Winds right now are stronger than they were yesterday, and they were 30 and 40 miles an hour, so there's, there's I guess, 60 mile an hour winds coming tonight. Uh, they got rain yesterday in San Bernardino. We're, we're in Riverside going out into the desert, but the snow and the rain is coming. Dion's coming in, it's so windy out there. Um, elevation dropped down to like 2,000 feet for tonight. And we're supposed to leave tomorrow, so I don't know if we're going to leave tomorrow or not, but uh, we got some of the stuff done already this morning. The first thing, I was just talking to everybody. Come over here. Um, let me push this button here. There we go. So I was just telling everybody that we were getting ready this morning a little bit. <laughs> We got, the, we got the barbecue grill in her car. We got the folding table folded up. Um, we decided to go ahead and put probably like a couple quarts of bleach down into the 30 gallon uh, portable water tank just in case we do use it. And so we, we are bleaching that out now. We filled it up with water and put a bunch of bleach in first. So that's going and we'll drain that all out through the uh, pump all throughout the system so the bathroom shower will be turned on the toilet everything will be turned on so everything gets bleached out and then uh, we will hold it in our holding tank and uh, we will keep that in the holding tank for a little bit until tomorrow if we do leave tomorrow if not it doesn't matter but then we will uh, dump our black water tank and then flush out our hose with what's in the gray water tank and that will be all clean because it's going to have bleach water in it and it's a little bit of soap from doing dishes and whatever and take a shower tonight so yeah that's what we're going to do and uh i'm going to show you what it's like outside right now so it's it's just a little windy again so i'm sorry for the noise but this is what it's like so uh let's go out there check it out All right, yeah, so we got rid of the, got rid of the, the grill, it's in her car, we got all this broke down. The rug itself will get up in the morning when we, or when we leave, we'll pick that up. The bikes, um, they're ready to go, all we gotta do is put them in the back. We got all this down, I took down the antenna from up there, and how we did the portable water. I kind of wanted to show you, but we didn't. Uh, not this one, this is the city water. The other one's a portable water tank going into, I think, 30 or 40 gallon tank underneath. And that's where we put the bleach and then we filled it up with water. Um, we bought this the last time. We had hose, we had, we had critters eat our brand new hose. We, and then we put the other section on it and they ate that one too. So I guess they don't like brown, so they're not eating the brown. But yeah, so we bought this little flush thing out which is leaking like heck, but oh well. And that's going to do really good tomorrow when we uh, leave. We'll rinse everything out. So, all right. So we went to the store. We bought some wine. We got some meat. We got some stuff. Went ahead and we loaded up the truck. And we got everything in there that we needed. We're going to get the the ladder is next. That goes in back to the back seat of my truck. Hold that. Down. But yeah, we got everything in here like we normally would have it. So the next thing to do is clean out this. This stuff has got to go inside. These are all the photos. This is uh, Dion's photos. Dion, you want to get that one and I'll get the next one. So tonight we're going to go through all the photos. I'm going to separate mine, give them to the kids. I want all this stuff cleaned up out of my truck today. 
We got toilet paper in here. We got everything in here. So we get all this stuff cleaned up. Oh, the wind is bad. It's supposed to snow or rain or something tonight. So we don't know. Here. The wind keeps moving them. Yep, so I'll get this stuff out. We'll clean up the truck. I gotta bring this seat down, put the ladder right there. And then we're ready to probably to get out of here tomorrow if this uh, weather uh, stops. I can't drive in this. It's way, way too windy to be driving. Uh, we haven't decided whether we're going to Mexico. We've been talking over it for the last three hours uh, as we went to go and do a little more shopping. Um, we have her truck, her car. So that means we'd have to drive her car and the camper and everything over to uh, Yuma and park it and then uh, walk into over there and stay for the night and then we can leave. We might do it, we might not. We might just, we might just go to uh, LA down that way and then we can just drive around LA and, and maybe record some things there. Maybe we can also go to uh, Disneyland. I don't know if, how long we're gonna be here. Um, we could do something kind of cool but I'm not sure what we're gonna do. So we'll figure it all out and uh, we'll let you know as we're doing it because that's the kind of people we are. So I'm gonna uh, get this box that I've got in here, this tote, and I'm gonna take it into the house and uh, I'm gonna call it quits for just a couple minutes here. Gonna have me a beverage. All right, guys. Well, good morning, everybody. <laughs> We've been up for about an hour now and uh, we're getting everything ready to go. Um, I'm gonna do the inside. Dion's gonna do the outside. I'll show you what I'm gonna do in just a few minutes, but I'm gonna show you what she's gonna do right now. And she's gonna go ahead and do it. She's got water on her face and water on her jacket because, you know, we filled up that tank with bleach water and uh, let it go through, but we didn't rinse it out. So we wanted to rinse it out today. It was just too darn cold. Now the mountains uh, didn't get any snow here nearby, but, where all of those clouds are up on top of that mountain, it got really a lot of snow. So uh, today is the day that we leave, and this is what we got to do. So we're going to first uh, take all this off, drain the hose out. But how we do it is uh, the black water has to go first, which is this one here. Bring it up a little bit. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so the one that's on this side is the gray or the black water. The one on this side is the gray water. So did you open up the gray water already? Yes, I didn't shut it last night. Well, that's not good because I've been pouring water through it for two hours. I know. Okay, so let's uh, do it right. Shut that. Okay, and now we will fill up the tank because this is what we do, and. I'll use the portable water, so keep filling that one up. All right, what we decided to do now is this. She's gonna keep filling up the portable water. Over there. And that's the water that goes into the tank. When she gets that done and fills up, then I'll run it one more time through. It'll go into the, it'll go into the gray water, which is now shut. She had it open. And that's the black water, which is shut. And then uh, we'll dump the black water. And then after we dump the black water, we'll clean the hose out with the gray water. And then this little connector will come off. We've uh, just put that on there. We'll rinse all that out. We'll put the hose that she's using now back on here. And it shoots water back into the, uh, into the darn uh, yeah, black tank, blank water tank. So that's what we're doing. We're getting ready out here. And then of course, we got all the jacks underneath. We've got to do the jacks, um, roll up the hoses, the electrical. Now she's gonna do all that. I'll come out and make sure it's done in a few minutes. We lost our cover in the wind, but oh well, we'll get a new one. They're like 20 bucks. Uh, tire spare tire is good. This is all locked in. I'm gonna bring this last in, um, but yeah, we'll get that. And then, that's her mess. Make sure all this stuff is locked up. And then in the camper itself, 
Oh, this is our little mess. Excuse our mess because we're throwing everything around right now. This is what we do. Uh, this air conditioner, uh, it is going to uh, go and roll up and it's going to go back around the corner over here. Meanwhile, this is going to go up and shut this so it stays shut. There's that. And then I've got to take the TV down, take this down. I just, what I do is I take this off and then take it off on here. And I set it over on the bed that's messy right now. That's our trash. When we go out the door, we'll dump the trash. Uh, and this area up here is my computer, my editing computer. And it is going to be, uh, take out the video card and I take it down and I put this on the bed also. So all the electronics is safe. Then I pack this all up with the pillows so everything stays good. Yep. So we've got about an hour's worth of work to do and we will be out if that. So uh, let's get this gimbal right. All right. So I'm gonna put down the camera and then we'll show you when we're done. Everything will be finished and we'll be on the road. I'm not telling you where we're going because I don't know where we're going yet. When we get to the entrance of the gate, I'm going to either turn left or right. I don't know. So we'll figure that out when we get that far. But yeah, it's uh, now almost 11. We're supposed to be out of here by 11. So I figure we'll be out of here by 12, 1230 at the latest. Okay, guys. So I'm going to jam on this and get this all done. And I'll come back to you and uh, show you where we're going. All right. So I got the editing computer up. I'm going to secure this all up and I'm going to put pillows wrapped around everything so none of this stuff can fall. Uh, TV is gone, as you can see, and uh, the monitor that's on the table is gone. I put that all on the bed over here. Now I'm going to stuff these pillows up around everything, make sure everything is all good. We don't want anything moving around too much. Yeah, and this is what we do every time we leave. Just takes us a few minutes. Took me no more than about 15 minutes to do this thing. So, let me set this down for a minute so I get the rest of these bunches of pillows in there. All right. So, we're gonna look at the wall. I stack all the pillows up so this stuff doesn't slide, but before we have the computer right here and I used to just leave it here until it screwed up and once it screwed up and I had to build it again and it cost me another $2,000, guess what? We take it and move it every time now. Let me get out the picture just for a second. Move the bags. All right, I got my pills taken today. I'm gonna take pills every day because I'm old. So I wanted to show you this, excuse me, so there's no water coming out now, and you can hear that, I don't know if you can hear it, listen, that rumble is actually our pump that's underneath here, and we turned off, listen, listen, ooh, you can hear it go off, all right, so the system is clean and free. I got the gray water tank filled. I'm gonna go out here now. And that's good, baby doll. Hi. I got all that taken care of in there. What are we doing here? Okay, so you dump the black water? Yep. Okay, good. Well, I was gonna show everybody how we did that. But anyway, so yeah, we did that already. Um, she's gonna roll up the hoses. She's already uh, undoing the, the jacks underneath. It doesn't take us long, we're out of here. I gotta get a pair of pliers and get this off and take the screw gun and unscrew it. Oh, I don't even need the pliers for this side. I'll take this connection off. This one was a booger. 
because this whole thing was spinning. So yeah, see it's not even on there very good like that. So take that. Put the little tripod out, stand this up for you so I can maneuver. Yeah, it's been fun here. It's a nice park. If you guys uh, ever get out this way, come check it out. Just time to go and we are good with that. I think I've had enough desert. Even though I was raised out here, I've had enough of it today <laughs> for the last three months. Hasn't been a fun time this the last three months. It's been pretty much working and uh, we need to go have some fun. So, just like that. So that's done. She's got all the jacks out already. I gotta put them in the truck. Um, that's gonna go in the truck. So right now I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna get the um, air conditioner and put it, stash it away. So I'm gonna turn this off for just a few minutes and then I'll show you when we're done. Well, we are all done inside. We are done outside. We've got everything put up. Um, we're gonna make a check after we get this up. We've jacked it up really high, super high. And then I'll back up and uh, Hopefully I get right there. We'll pull this out so it releases it. And uh, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. Hook it up and get out of here. So when we get out, like I said, we can turn left or we can turn right. And we really don't know which way we're going yet. No. So we're gonna tell you in a few minutes <laughs> but meanwhile, let's show you the rest of the stuff. Well, we're ready to leave here. And uh, got everything all packed up. We got the uh, sway bars on. We got to get this out from underneath here. Raise it all up, or lower it down rather. Hopefully it works good. But everything uh, over here is done. We are finished. Finished on this job, going to do it next. Let's see how that looks. What you try to do is you raise it up, you jack it up really high, and then uh, you bring it back down so the jack goes out from underneath it, and it actually levels the whole playing field from the camper all the way this way. You can see. So you want to look for. Let's see. You want to look for your 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 wheel wells to be pretty similar. Is it up on? Almost. Is it off the? Uh, okay. So yeah. So it's pretty good. I say we pretty much have the same gap between there than we do over here. Maybe this is a little bit higher up here, but yeah. But we've got. Uh, 7,500 pounds plus bikes and everything else in the back of the truck. Thank God we got new shocks. So let's go look around real quick. The truck looks good. We just checked the oil. The um, stuff in the back is all secured. We've got everything we need. All our chairs, our rake, our propane tank, our bikes. We've got that. She's got all this done. And we're gonna make sure this doesn't fly off because we already lost the cover to it and we lost the back cover to the tire so but she's got all this done this um needs to be tight somewhat so hopefully that's tight enough i don't know if it's too tight or not tight enough but uh yeah so there's that oh where is it at i got it on itself yep. okay there you go got it no i can't get my finger out of it it got stuck here i'll hold this one 
All right. that one. Teamwork makes the dream work. All right, awnings in. All these are locked. Little cubbies. We got chocks out from underneath all the tires. I've already done that. We already went to the back and showed you all this. It's all good. So, now my friends, it's pretty much time to go. Ready? Ready. All right. Max is ready. <laughs> so, we're going to leave you just like this. Yeah. This is the end of our video today, us leaving. So check out next week where we end up. Um, I think it's going to be interesting. Uh, we have two different choices to go, and I think we were going to go for one of those choices. I don't know. We're still talking about it, actually. <laughs> so uh, we, will, we will see you next week at uh, 6 o'clock in the morning on Sunday. Yes. And uh, we'll have an all-fresh, brand-new video out for you. You guys have a good week. And uh, you can always write us at msfitzsadventures at gmail.com. Uh, you can see us on Instagram, or you can see us on Facebook. And you can see us on our blog, which is misfitsadventures.com. Uh, we also have all links to our website, or actually our YouTube channel. And then uh, on our website, we do have our blog that she writes. And we have all our pictures and everything else on there, too. So we've got a lot of different media that you can uh, go check us out on. Hey, if you liked this episode, give us a thumbs up. We appreciate it. Um, it's been a fun time here at the KOA, and we want to thank them for having us work here. Yeah. It's been fun, and uh, it's over, and we hope to see them on the flip side someday, right? Yep. All right, guys. You guys have a good one. Have a good week. Be safe. We'll see you next week. Next week. Bye. Bye, guys. <laughs>